The Kausei package is designed to be used as a command line application, but the way that we've installed it, we have to call it through the node modules directory. Our system doesn't have any notion of Kausei. Let's fix that. Now we'd like to install this globally, so let's find some help on global installation. Use npm help and search for global. Sweet, we got a doc. This is the uh, npm folders doc, and it talks about folder structure used by npm. I love the very simple wording here. It says npm puts various things on your computer. That's its job. This document will tell you what it puts where and gives us a very nice brief explanation. So local installs the default and it puts stuff in the node modules directory. And that's what we've seen so far. That's what we've been experiencing. However, there's another option. There's a global install. We use the dash G flag and it puts stuff wherever node is installed. We should install things locally if we want to require them in a program of our own or install them globally if we want to run them via the command line, which is what we want. Additionally, we can use them in both places. So we can install this again with a G flag to get it on our system. Cool, that was perfect. We'll type Q to quit and uh, use this new knowledge that we have. So we'll type NPM install, or we can shorten that to I, which it's alias to. Use that G flag for global. And again, Kause. It did some linking wizardry and came up successful. So let's try this again. Kause. I am free. Now other commands respond to this G flag as well. So we can run npm ls global calse and see that it is installed globally. 